Things are shaping up pretty nicely to kick off the holiday weekend. An area of low pressure that's been our nemesis over the past week or so has taken kind of a track across the peninsula now up toward the Carolina and Georgia coast. It's going to be moving inland as a non-tropical low later today or tonight. And some drier air building in behind that it will sweep into the uh, South Florida peninsula, really putting the old kibosh on the uh, rain chances today. I can't say the rain chances zero. It's more like 10 to 20 percent, but very isolated as opposed to what we've seen lately. And on the water vapor animation, the uh, brown coloring is what you want to focus on here, that, uh, that kind of dark shading right there. That's drier air that's wrapping in under the base of that area of low pressure. So just in the nick of time to save at least part of our holiday weekend. Future radar as we head toward noon, no rain showing up anywhere but with, with a lot more sunshine. It'll be really warm out there today. A couple of pop up storms along the coast or near the coast, mainly South County as we head toward four this afternoon and uh, they'll be moving off the coast, maybe on the Broward Palm Beach County line right around eight o'clock. So in South County, just keep an open mind for some possible storms later today and this evening. Tomorrow morning, starting off dry and as we head toward the the afternoon hours. It'll be mostly sunny, then a few more scattered showers, storms, mainly the Palm Beaches at four o'clock, and then we'll see uh, maybe a cluster of showers and storms down toward Boca and Del Rey as we head toward eight o'clock tomorrow evening. Beach forecast, big news here, rip currents and some swells, so stay out of the water, especially with the kids. The rip current risk is going to be high out there today. The marine forecast, small craft advisory, the sea's not that bad near shore, but offshore, they could be over 12 feet. So again, exercise caution if you are boating out there today for today, tomorrow and Monday are going to keep that rain chance only about 20 to 30 percent. So most of us stay dry again, a pretty good holiday weekend. Then the rain chance goes up with another system on the way toward the second half of next week.